uh, we're more of a sports school. Um, as you know, my name is Daisy, also go by A, and I'm a freshman at Bryan High School. Germs make you swear! Um, and this is my poem, The Unborn Problem, trigger warning for abortion, child abuse, and sexual assault. On June 24, 2022, a Supreme Court made mainly of men voted to overturn Roe versus Wade, dismissing a law that protected the reproductive rights of all women in the United States. It came out around this time that there was a 10-year-old girl seeking an abortion in Ohio. After many weeks of horrific arguing about if the story was fake or not, a man was officially arrested and charged with the rape of said 10-year-old girl. This poor little girl then had to travel across state lines to receive a potentially life-saving abortion. In a country of liberty and justice for all, we were quicker to dismiss this poor child who's already been betrayed by a man she thought she could trust than admit that maybe, just maybe, there might be consequences to the actions made on June 24th. How do we get to a point where we're putting a literal clump of cells that doesn't even know what life is over a living, breathing human whose only mistake was being born with a uterus? In seventh grade, I learned that my mom had previously had an abortion before she had me. As much as I wish I had an older sibling when I was growing up, I probably wouldn't be here if she had carried that child to term. And I don't know about you, but me being born to my parents, fully prepared for a child with stable jobs and ending up on this stage, is a much better solution than two kids fresh out of college having a kid they don't want while still trying to figure out their own future. But this is no longer a solely political issue. This is not red versus blue. This is human rights. I don't know about you, but I've been told my whole life that I was dramatic. I was too angry, I was rude, and I wasn't acting like a lady. And so I toned it down. But I am angry, and I'm not afraid to be rude when I need to be. And I'm not a lady, I'm a woman. After being told all my life to shut my mouth and sit down, I am, ready, I am up here today to open it and say, we are not gonna take this sitting down. So actions have consequences, and it's time to reap what we've sown.